hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is gabby so in today's video i will be creating the wet style look of my hair a couple people said i should try it out i mean i was a little skeptical at first because certain styles does make my forehead pop out more but here i am trying to style out so stay tuned guys okay so for this style everyone is saying that your hair has to be super wet like soaking wet i guess the wet look so as you can see my hair is like super wet and my back is like drenched <laughs> i don't know if you can see that but um so to keep it a, a little um moisturized i put this tresemme conditioner Ugh. i don't know if you can see that but yeah i put tresemme conditioner in my hair just to leave it a little bit more damp so it won't dry as quickly so i'm gonna do that and then i'm just gonna like start putting a little bit more in there because i feel like it's starting to dry up like so like i said this look has to be like extremely wet <laughs> like i said i really didn't want to do this hairstyle because my forehead as you can see zing <laughs> it's like extremely big but let's see how this style comes out guys so i'm just right now i'm just like moisturizing it and then I'm gonna like put up. I noticed a lot of people were doing it um, side in the side part and middle part, but I'm gonna try it going straight back because I think that's more considered like the wet look. <laughs> so let's see how this goes. So I'm gonna be using my dimming brush, some more water. <laughs> For right now to get it like extremely uh, super defined I'm gonna be using this but it's actually pretty good so far though I'm doing this pretty fast because my baby is like occupied and she's drinking her milk right now and that lasts about 30 minutes so you're gonna see me do this like extremely fast if you have a baby, you should know. <laughs> so now I'm just gonna start by brushing my hair straight back to create that slick back look. And I'm going to be using a lot of Eco Salon Gel. And I mean a lot. So my hair won't stick up because if you are a curly hair girl, then you know how it is trying to get your hair to look completely neat it's without any flyaways so hopefully with adding all this gel in and brushing it a few times that I can create this neat sleek look okay so now i'm going to take the top part that i have left out and apply more of the product and slick it all the way back and as you can see guys my brush is basically going to be my best friend for this style so you know i'm just trying to achieve this cat williams slick back but the curly hair version so hopefully in the end it stays this way because having natural hair you cannot predict these things but leave me a comment below if you have or will try this style out I'm mad because I cannot find my edges brush, so I have to use a toothbrush and do the old school way. So, watch and see how this goes because I am not the best at doing this at all. <laughs> so, I have naturally thin edges. It doesn't matter what I do, my edges stay pretty thin. So, here I am trying to pretend like I have some type of flawless swoopy edges that a lot of you girls have, but unfortunately, this is what I have to do when I have to fake it till I make it. <laughs> So I am going to add my scarf just so that my hair can stay a little flat and so I can continue to keep that sleek look because like I said, having natural curly hair, you cannot predict anything. It may stick up, so I need something to at least make sure that it stays slick down. So as you can see guys, I am adding a little bit more water to my hair because I did notice that my hair was a little bit dry and for this look it has to be extremely wet and you have to have a lot of product in your hair like I said earlier. So hopefully by doing this it stays how I want it to. 
So I'm finally done with this style. I do like how it came out, but it is not my favorite. So at least I can say that I finally tried it out. But I do thank you guys for watching. If you do like how this style came out, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to click that subscribe button so you're not missing out on any of my videos.